Hello everyone. In this video I'm going to show you how to use the GoPro Studio to import your GoPro photos from your time lapse and create an actual workable movie you can use in Premiere or Avid or Final Cut Pro. First thing you want to do is you actually want to connect your GoPro to your computer and export all of your photos from your time lapse into one single folder folder on your desktop. Once you've done that, you can open up your GoPro Studio, select Import New Files, and then you can select all of your photos in order, otherwise your time lapse won't look right, and import them into the GoPro Studio. Now as you can see here, the GoPro Studio has already taken those individual folders and combined them into one playable video. So if I press play, you can see my time lapse. Now you do have some other options, some advanced settings. I'm not going to get into any of that in this video. Basically just going to show you how to throw the video into GoPro Studio export it out as a video file. So now that I've imported all my files, I'm going to select the file name and change it. I'm just going to label it time lapse. You can also change the file directory to where this gets saved to. For me, I have it right on my desktop. So I'm going to add clip to conversion list. And then I'm just going to select convert all. Now once this is completed, in the conversion list, it's going to bring me to step two, the edit process. In this video, we're not going to do any editing to it. We're just going to skip right over step two, go right to step three, and export the video. It's not that this video is pretty much completed. It doesn't take very long. As you can see, it was only a minute and 17 seconds. To select down here, proceed to step two. And this little template browser pops up. You can just go ahead and close that. And I'm going to select step three. Well, first, actually, as you've seen, it wants you to select your video. So I'm going to select my video over here on the left, select export. And I'm going to select 1080 for playback on my computer or television. I'm going to label it time lapse four, since I already have the same time lapse saved in here. Now once it goes through the exporting process, it's going to put it in the folder that of your choice. It's going to be labeled whatever you just saved it as. And so you can navigate and find your video and play it back. If you wanted to do further editing, you can always take it and drop it into After Effects or drop it into Premiere and continue on with your editing process um, and blending it in with your other footage. So thanks for watching. This has been the updated video on how to do a time lapse using the GoPro Studio and your GoPro camera. These are great products. If you don't have one and you're watching this video, hopefully it inspires you to go out and get one. Thanks for watching. Check back for another video soon.